Hey guys, I'm Captain Duck, and it's time for some more Within a Deep Forest. Last time, uh, well, we did a lot of things. I started the game, uh, beat uh, Shinnok Rain, and uh, other areas. A little minecart thing, and Elgius, and Utopioka, and whatever it's called. <laughs> we got the yoga, the yoga ball. And, uh, well, let's continue the game, and see where we can go now. We have uh, more half of the balls, which means about half half of the game is done. But uh, well, we're not really that far, I think. It's it's a tough game, and uh, we still have a lot to do. Anyway, now we have the yoga ball, which is pretty slow and pretty weird, but can make giant jumps. We can use this to get to some new places. Um, I forgot where though. Maybe this yoga ball lead can lead you into that wind cave. Oh yeah, also the yoga ball is impervious to spikes. Apparently. Um, let's see. How does the yoga ball handle the wind here? Not very well. Actually, actually it goes pretty well. Um, also, I think it should be enough to look in those little caves we saw way down at the bottom right of the world. So, let's check there. Wonder if this will fly here. Also, can't go up there. <laughs> Wasn't a little up there. Oh man. Um. That's another nice part of the, the newer knit games, which have like a more open map also. Yeah, yoga. Yoga um, is not that affected by the wind. And what was I was trying to say is the, the knit games, especially knit underground, which have a giant map and won't let you, you, let you bounce off the screen like in this game. Because, yeah, in mid games you'll just jump up to a new screen, you won't bounce up like this. But, well, let's see um, how Niflis uh, improved his game in between all these games. Um, there's not a thing in here. Well, also, now we're here. There was that dragon which killed us when we went to the right. How about if we jump all the way there with the yoga ball? Maybe he wasn't doesn't like yoga. Well, I think he'll probably still kill us pretty bad. Let's see what happens. Nope. Jump. Um. So the little platform below us here. I remember something being there, but yeah, this is not going to work. Oh well. Oh, how about the cat? Do you cat ball thing? Do you like yoga? You like yoga. Okay. Uh, let's fall down a couple levels here. And here's the dude which saves the dealer ball. Um, okay, how about we save first? Let's try to jump to the right. Also, do you kill us? You probably would. <laughs> you probably would. Okay, let's try jumping to the right. Now we have yoga power. Jump. No, dragon doesn't want to go. Let us go to the right. Okay, then there's the yoga cave somewhere to the left of here. I remember this being a yoga cave at least. And with the yoga ball, we can get in. This is a crystal path. Oh god. I remember this place. This uh, is not a fun, not a fun place. This is the glass ball level. Here we need the glass ball, I think, if I remember right. Crystal Pass is also one of those levels which gets returns in uh, the newer Knit games. And yeah, it's one of the zones in Knit Underground as well. And. Uh, should have gone there to the left, I think. Okay, let's get back here first. I want to see what's to the left there. I don't think we can go there at the moment. Let's try and check it at least. Also, you, Mr. Robot Guy. 
Actually, that's not a robot, it's a little house. Oh, <laughs> just one time. Come on. The yoga ball is weird to control. That's the power of yoga. Now we can go here. And what's over here? Over these little houses with little people. This ring thing. Which counts as a sort of bumper. And yeah, lasers kill us. Yeah. Okay, okay. We can't go there yet. We need the glass ball to go there. And I don't think we can take the glass ball from here because some of these drops are pretty tall. And yeah, remember the glass ball cannot fall from a great height. Um, so here we start. We save here, die, and here we start the glass ball run. Glass balls are impervious to lasers, but are susceptible to heights. Oh boy. So what would normally be an easy drop to the level is now a hard thing. Because we need to jump to the right here. And <laughs> not hit the wall either. And this is why I hated this place. Yeah. Yeah. You can feel the pain. What? Shouldn't that have... Oh, fuck. Okay, I shouldn't have tried jumping here at all. I should just hold the... <laughs> left button. Hold the... <laughs> Holy fuck. So now I'm making the jump, but I'm still going too fast in most of the times. <laughs> and this all on just this screen. This is just the introductory puzzle to this. Well, at least once we finish the screen, we will be able to continue on. Problem is, I'd, I'd skip this, but you can't. Yeah, we need to finish all the areas before we can move on to the final area of the game to stop Dr. Cliche and his uh, freeze bomb. Okay. Okay. No more beeping laser sound, at least. Oh boy. So look at the little nice people living down here. The little cute little houses. Which are filled with glass shards. Uh, here we have to do a pretty tough jump to the right. Um, or do we? Could choose another ball, but yeah, no. Next screen will have a laser. I'm pretty sure of that. Okay, well that's this screen done once. And yeah, this the next screen does have a laser here. So laser's gone now. Hmm. Now where to go? Left or right? Well, let's try the upper path here, or right even. Um, going upwards as a glass ball isn't that hard, although it takes a little while to gain momentum. And 
Got to be careful you don't gain too much female momentum. <sighs> okay, let's check the screen to the left here first. So I'm not sure I so I'm sure I don't miss anything. Oh, lots of people here. Yeah, this is a uh, another glass ball thing. Oh. Uh, both choices still seem valid. Hmm, my gut says go to the left first. So let's do that. It would be nice if I hit that save point here. Which is about four or five screens away. That worked, okay. Um, okay, again, my gut said that, but there's no way to get up here. Maybe if I switch to Yoga Ball. Although I'm pretty sure that's not going to be it. I remember this area being like glass ball only. This is uh, yeah, not the way to go. So I basically screwed myself by going here. This is a return path. Yeah, if I ever fall down here with using another ball or something then I could use this to return to here. Okay, now let's save down there. Because it's closer to my goal of the top right here. Okay. And yeah, be careful not to smash myself into the wall. be annoying to do this every time I die, because, yeah. <sighs> Easy to... It takes a while for the glass ball to gain height. And, uh, yeah. The way the death is handled, I think, is just it's a measure of how fast you're going when you're near the wall. And, uh... Yeah, you gotta be careful. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay, so now we're here with the glass ball. Oh. Next jump? Yeah. Um, bottom or top? Well, let's do bottom first. Oh boy. Um. Why are there blocks on the left side here? Uh, maybe we should hit this. Oh god. Yeah. Um, okay, so the, the idea is use this bouncy button and survive somehow. And yeah, going to need a top platform for that, of course. Like this. Uh, and now, once I've done that, I can't. Yeah. Can't go near the save point again because a little save, little laser near the save point, is what activates those blocks on the left side. <laughs> oh boy! Okay, come on. Now, oh, this is a little bit more fair. If I go down here. Okay. Be careful.
careful and going down. <sighs> Using that way. This is really going to be sounds, bodily sounds of the video, eh? Oh, yeah. That's something. <laughs> what can I say? This place is madness. And uh, not jump into the place here and continue. And save point. Okay. Now what? Hmm. What's that thing in the top right here? Um, doesn't seem to be anything. Can't do anything here either. That thing I can go up again. I could get go down here if I use this. It's, that'll also kill me. Um, bottom right seems like a deterrent path, so let's forget about that. Let's. How about we just go left here? No. Let's check that again, but. It didn't seem like anything we could do. Uh, so check the ceiling here. No. Yeah, there's no way we're going to land on that and survive on the left side of the screen, I think. This might be possible with another type of ball, but it would be very hard to do. And I remember this being glass only, so... Okay, how about if I go here first? Then... Hmm... Yeah, I'm going to have to... Jump to the top right part from the ring. Then the box at the bottom here will be gone. And... Oh boy. I'll be able to go down there. Ah, uh, why? Why does it launch me to death immediately? There I reduced my speed, but I still fell too much. Oh, that was stupid. <laughs> Can't be bouncing when you hit the ceiling. Can't be bouncing when you hit the ceiling. Come on. I'm just getting frustrated. This is... well... That was the easy part. This is the hard part. Jumping on this thing in a manner to launch me to the top right. Okay. Oh, Niflos. Your games are good in this pretty fucking good, but this is also frustrating as fuck. Your level design is awesome, but yeah, this is frustrating. <sighs> Jump on it just a little bit too high and then yeah, you're lost. Can't do this as any other ball because of the lasers. Oh, okay. That's it apparently. Now we go down here slowly. Save point. Um 
Yeah, that's not going to work. Also, there's a little dinosaur thingy at the bottom over there. Oh, I live. Okay. So those things work. And we can't follow him. Let's um, continue to the left. Save point. Um, top part. Why not? So there seems to be a deactivated laser at the bottom there, but... Hmm... Okay, we're saved here as long as we... Yeah. That is a way to get back. We need to go up the top part here. Uh, the goal should be somewhere in the top left of the map. Okay. Jesus, 20 minutes in. <laughs> the only thing we've done in this video is Crystal Path. Previous video I've would have done a couple of a couple of um, zones already. But yeah, here's where the game gets a lot harder. Do uh, okay. Now what? Oh no. <sighs> okay, for fun, <laughs> let's try and check this within our ball. Let's use the purple ball, see how far we can get. Come on. And also, let's move the mouse out of the screen. Because, um. This should be possible with the purple ball, but I just know there's going to be something on the top. Left. It's going to require a laser. Should be able to jump under there. Um, I feel like I'm wasting my time like this, but. Well, this practice, I guess, for doing the boss. These jumps with the glass ball. So like sit here. Oof, oof. Hold it for one little bounce. Nah, that was two bounces already. Okay, if this run doesn't work, I'm going back to glass since that's what we need. I'm pretty sure. One bounce. <laughs> okay, back to glass. Okay. That's not glass. Okay. Uh, watch this possible puzzle being possible with another type of ball after I've done this. Okay. Sigh. I shouldn't press to the left before I should <laughs> glass ball seems to be able to get just around these little corners somehow okay 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 now not fall down here because I'm certain that will bring us back Let's go to the left here first. Now it's going to be up here. Probably certain death. <sighs> yup. Okay, so on that screen we should go upwards. That's not our death. Come on. What the hell happened there? I know. Man, this isn't even that hard of a jump since... Well, 
compared to all the other jumps I've done in this mother fucking crystal path place. Man, uh, mid underground crystal path is a lot easier, but mid underground also has saving every damn screen. So now we're here with the glass ball. And we're actually able to go to the left now. Aha! Uh -huh. Hmm. What's the idea here? These things. Remove blocks. <laughs> um. I came to the bottom thing. And that didn't work. That just killed me. If I f I'll drop down the bottom here, then I'll just die as well. What now? Hmm. Should I go to the right now? Once I've pressed the thing? Uh, let's explore this little level thingy first. Oh, that wasn't what I intended. Um, you know what, let's do yoga ball. I don't get it. What's the way I should go now? Well, let's go back to glass. Um, What if I go to the right here? I'm safe to the left spot now. There must be a reason for that. Also, is it even possible to land here? No, it isn't. Just like I expected, but it might have been possible to land to the right there. Okay, what if I go down here again? Not possible? Going to right there isn't possible. Okay. X point. How about if I just go down here? I could go down here, but that would lead me all the way back. We go to the left there? Seriously? Maybe go to the right using this ball and a uh, good jump. Wait a minute. Hmm. Something. Okay, let's try the left wall of this screen. I'm really perplexed at the moment. Uh, I figured it out some time before in the past since I've played this game, but there doesn't seem to be a fake wall to the left there. Let's go back, go to that tunnel to the right. Was that what we needed all along and have I been doing, doing a couple of puzzles here for nothing? And you can't go to the right he from here, right? What if I do touch one of these things? Then go down here? 
Nope. I do not want to hit that save point. That'll put me back a whole long way. Okay, I don't want to save here, but well. What if we go down here? Fucking hell. Ah! <sighs> this is all we needed. We never needed to go up there. Motherfuckers, I just did a whole plot for nothing. Escape, escape, we're done with the level, we have the ball. God damn it. <laughs> uh, fuck you. What ball is this anyway? It's ball seven? I forget. So, ball seven... ...is terrible for bouncing. Might be used for something else. Well, we'll need it to get to the final puzzle, so we have it. Um, next up, I think, is the UFO level. UFO level should give us some more things to work with. And uh, I think the yoga ball is one of the better ways to get up here. UFO. Oh, come on. Okay. The UFO, that's that hover thing. This is also an another unit level. Uh, there was something with this uh, level. Um, there was something like maybe go left all the way first, then go right all the way, or it was a go right all the way, then go left all the way. I forget. Well, follow the left wall is something which recommended in Mazes. So let's try going left first. Um, also, aliens. Those things, yeah, reverse your controls. Uh, okay, controls normalized. Um, this is just wind. And to use the wind, I should use the normal ball. Okay. Uh, Mr. the new ball. How are you with wind? I think you should work. Well, those work fine for wind uh, measures. But uh, can we actually get over to the left now? Hmm, maybe if I jump from here. Nope, that's not going to work. Okay, so Mr. the new ball is not going to work. I think blue ball is the best now. Um, here, just just platforming. Come on, okay. Yeah, we fucked up. So let's go to the right first, push the switch, go to the left. And of course I did the wrong choice in the beginning. Oh well. You can at least use this little return path to get back a whole lot faster. Or actually use this to start on the whole right side of the map. 
Yeah. Yeah, and this is a one-way thing. Okay, now... The journey to the left. Which is pretty damn hard. Now, I wonder if we should save now we've pressed that button. Let's try not to. Because, yeah, the button needs to be... Stay pressed. Hmm. Okay, well, I'm dead now and the button is still pressed. What if I save? One life will be pretty damn tough. That thing, will it kill me? I have no idea. It doesn't kill me, but it does push me back. It's like a flying bumper, okay. And bumper in the pinball sense of bumper. Um, ball here. Nope. Oh, that works as well. Go on. Best commentary here. I'm sorry, guys. Come on. Okay, blue ball for a change. Maybe yoga ball. That works. Um, there's wind in this part. And there's another one of those guns. Okay. Saved. Now well, we've done this before. Oh, now there's the little alien dude. Which kills us, but if he touches us. Um, and, oh yeah. Reverse controls, gotta love it. Luckily only for that screen. And now we'll know if we need to do this without saving. I don't think Niflis will ask that from us. He normally the game is every sometimes like in the Crystal Path I would go for like maybe four screens without saving, but yeah, that's not it. But he won't do that for this, I think. close, but here we are, and yeah, 
Press enter. Okay, thanks, little alien dude. Now we've got uh, the super bouncy ball. This will get us into some other places. And we can risk escape twice, and we're done. Oh boy. Um, we have ball number four now. We'll need eight, nine, and ten. Let's try ball number four, which is a super bouncy ball. This uh, should go pretty damn high. Maybe even high enough to get up to the left side of the world there. But yeah. Um, let's uh, hit the video here. Let's have a save point. This is good enough for now. Let's save the game. And uh, let's continue this in another video. About two thirds of the game done, I think. Hopefully with one or two more videos I should be able to finish this. Finish this even. Um, okay, well, we'll see. Uh, for now, this has been enough. I'll see you guys later. Later, guys.